in the last year and a half or so, we're getting a lot sicker patients coming here. We realized with our post-COVID patients that were coming in for their regular therapy, they would fatigue quicker, they had a harder time keeping up with the therapy. So we decided that what can we do to try to get them to do a little bit more, but make it fun, make it motivating. All the way up above your head. It's a typical therapy ball that you would get anywhere, and we just put it in a bucket. Uh, and again, it's the movement of the arms around the ball. They're sticking with the beat of the music. It helps with their memory. It helps with their fine motor skills. The music is so motivating. It just lifts people's spirits. So to incorporate that all within the activity is really beneficial. We introduced the harmonica. And we have harmonica programs where we teach them how to breathe in, how to breathe out. And it really helps expand their lungs. And we found this is really working with the post-COVID patients, too. Because a lot of them have shortness of breath. A lot of them are very fatigued. It was really good. And um, we're just having a good time. They want to participate, and by doing it, they're getting better. And that's, that's really the, the biggest key. It's good for the lungs and your mind and everything. It stirs up the blood. Uh, instead of just sitting. Nobody wants to be here, they want to be home, you know, but to see them smile and to be able to motivate them to get home quicker, and I think that's the most important thing. Our goal here is to give them life again. Remind them that you can go home and have a life afterwards. Right.